Hey, hey, good morning. Morning. Oh, hey, that, this, don't, don't worry about this. I, it, I'm, it, it's all fine. I mean, it's not like I'm out in the garage drinking Pepsis in the morning and hiding from my wife so she doesn't know I'm drinking Pepsis in the morning. Don't worry. Uh, not a problem. I mean, it's not like I'm drawn to this Oh, sweet nectar of the gods, and like I couldn't resist it. And, and it's not like, uh, I mean, it's not like this is my favorite sound in the whole world. Oh, and the bubbles, I love the bubbles. Okay, maybe, little problem. Maybe, just a little problem. Actually, you know, scripture talks about the idea that uh, there are some things in, the, in life that are not bad, but when they control us, then they become bad. And um, I want to talk to you about one of those things in my life today very seriously. Uh, this should be another issue, but we'll get to that later. Uh, Facebook. Uh, very simply, about a year and a half ago, uh, I really got involved in Facebook for the first time during the whole COVID and have been trying to share messages of encouragement, occasionally something I think is funny, rare occasion, a picture of my grandchildren, put that on there. I've had a great time. I've been thankful for do that. to do that. I've been able to connect with some old friends, and I like that. However, however... Uh, I also have found that I just have become an addict. Uh, I'm on Facebook too much when I shouldn't be. I've been, uh, you know, spending, uh, devoting time that I don't want to. I haven't really ever uh, contributed to any of the nastiness, but I watch some of that and it doesn't help. So, here's the thing, for my own, and I want to stress that this is just about me. I'm not suggesting this to anybody else, and if you can continue to use Facebook to connect with people and encourage people and share truth, great. Because I've been thankful that I've been able to do that, and Facebook has never shut me down or edited anything I had to say in sharing anything. It's not really about them at all. It's not about you. It's about me. But it is about me. Uh, I have just decided that for my own physical, because it's all connected, uh, spiritual, mental, uh, um, emotional health, the best thing for me to do would be to close up my Facebook page. Uh, so I'm going to do that, but again, I'm not attacking Facebook. In fact, our church is going to continue to use it to share the messages of truth. But I just kind of wanted you to know, if anybody cares, might be two of you out there that actually care, that I won't, uh, that I won't be doing this anymore. I'm going to shut down my page and, uh, and say goodbye in that way. So, kind of, uh, I didn't think I'd feel this way. I kind of feel a little sad. I don't know why I'm out in the garage. <laughs> Maybe it's because I've had too many Pepsis in the morning, something like that. But, uh, but it, you know, thank you for those of you that have encouraged me by sharing some things back. And uh, I trust that we will, moving, moving forward, be able to keep our focus on the main thing, which is Jesus Christ and Him, him being the only hope for individual lives for redemption, for our churches, uh, for our families, for our country.